Liverpool people, friends from uh, wherever. Hope you're all well this Monday evening. And uh, yeah, another little project today. The beast that's behind me, as you can see. Uh, the 3305 again. So, today's, or to this evening's challenge. Sorry, I'm, this thing doesn't like dark much. But uh, yeah, this evening's challenge is the steering again, and the bushes, and a new tool to play with. So, guys, I'd uh, like you to come along with me whilst we ream out some bushes. Could be an interesting thing. I don't know. Some of you will find it interesting. Some of you will find it totally boring. But, you know, that's life. But thank you for looking anyway. Hope to gain your subscription by this. And, uh, yeah, it'd be nice to have you guys follow along with the Shed of Hope and what we do here. Anyhow, there you go. Right, so, without further ado, let's look at what we're playing with. So, here we have the new toy, an adjustable reamer. Those of you on Facebook know all about that, because I was really excited when that came. And it's to put this shaft in, this shaft here, that we are... Uh, yeah, playing with and hopefully fitting. So, tools tonight, one adjustable reamer. And this is the wrong thing, but it's going to be right for us. As you can see, it has got what is known as a Morse taper on the end. That is designed to fit in a drilling machine or such. Um, yeah, so we're going to use it by hand, using the adjustable spanner to turn it. And then we're going to do this. Ah, we have a cat. Yeah, he's come to help, just to keep us on our toes. So it's adjustable. In there, you can see an Allen key, or an Allen thing. We have an Allen key down there, look. There you go, one Allen key. That is to turn that screw. And when you turn that screw, what it does is it brings these teeth. Let's get it in shot. There we go. The teeth on the outside, it makes them bigger. Okay, so by turning this, it makes that big. It's very difficult to film this one-handed. But anyhow, there we go. So that's what we're doing. Got some WD-40 for a bit of lube. Don't know if we'll need that just to tap it down through a little bit and keep turning. It might just drag itself through. So without further ado, I'll show you what we're doing. So we're going to come in here and there's the bush holes. So there we go, guys. That's uh, us doing what we do best and we're going to try and put that thing through so i'm going to set you guys up over here so that you know you've got a reasonably good view and uh well, i've got to mine that on and off button because this is my second time of doing it i've been putting that damn on and off button so i'm going to set you up there somewhere perhaps is that good for you can you see can you see can you all see yep somewhere near there we go there's the there's the old so let's get some things in here Oh, right, WD-40, that, and the Allen key. So, oh, drop it all the way down here. So, the first thing I'm going to do is spray her down with some of this. And then, we're going to pop this down in there. And look at that, it's actually going all the way through to start with. So, that tells me you need to adjust it a bit. So, I'm going to in the end, look, and I'm just going to give it just a, just a, you know, start gently. So, we'll try it again. And, yeah. Okay, she's still going straight through. So, we're going to wind on her a bit more. There we go. Ah, trying to get it in shot for you guys. This is going to be tight. Oh. Mm, that's a little bit too little. I'd much rather. Okay, we're going to start at that. Okay, so I'm going to go under here now a little bit and get the old adjustable spanner and give her some rotation and see if we can push it down for it and do that. Okay, so you're not going to see a lot at this point. It's at the back of my head probably. And we're going that way. And she goes straight down through again. So, let's tighten up a bit more. So we'll try that. Keep going in little baby steps, you see. Tiny baby steps. So we'll give her a bit more spray. Because that's got to help. 
I mean, they're really already doing this, but there we go. And she's dragging herself down through really nicely, though, which is good. Let me get the old spanner on there again. As you can see, she is coming down through nice. thing is, when we knock these in, there's a burr, so this probably just burred the things a bit, so that's it, open her up again, and down through we go again, more spare hay, because she has removed some material, I can see bits of golden on there, so, which is actually phosphor bronze, for those of you who know, but, uh, yeah, so this is the wrong tool, doing, hopefully, a somewhere near right job. really tight but she is dragging herself through which is great makes me do a bit more spare hay there we go looking good looking good folks might actually bring you in for a bit of a close-up of this actually so I'm gonna have to be quick because this is going to take hours to download I'm gonna have to do this overnight because we get like 0.3 of a meg upload speed here. It's really good. We're really looking forward to Skynet. So I'm going to bring you guys in here a bit closer so you can sort of see what's going on. Uh, can I? I'll bring you in. 